Today I want to talk about tips for saving money for your mission. The blessings of missionary work are infinite and eternal, but there are also a lot of costs and sacrifices involved in missionary work, and one of those costs are the dollars and cents you need to be saving for your mission. I want to start out um, <clears throat> with, uh, with a quote from President Spencer W. Kimball. He said, how wonderful it would be if every boy could totally and largely finance his own mission. Uh, so I, I, of course, completely agree with President Kimball that um, th there are great blessings that come from young men saving money and paying for their own mission, even if their parents can afford to pay for it for them. So uh, today I want to talk about uh, how, how uh, young men and young women preparing for a mission can, uh, can save money to pay for uh, some or all of, of their mission. The first tip is to start early. Um, I have a, a, a little boy and when he was four years old I gave him a piggy bank so he could start saving for his mission. I've heard of a lot of people starting even earlier than, than that. Uh, when you're young, you're enthusiastic, um, and you can also um, get into good habits of, of saving money. So it's a good idea to start early. You can also be earning interest from a very early point. Um, second, um, find chores that you can do uh, to earn some money. Talk to your parents, family, friends, neighbors, uh, and uh, see if they have chores you can do, mow lawns, shovel snow from driveways, and so forth to earn money for your mission. Third, have a budget or a plan uh, for how you're going to save and spend your money. Uh, I'd recommend saving probably at least 50% uh, of, of all the money you earn to put into your missionary fund. Uh, also, don't forget to, uh, to budget 10% for tithing. Fourth, uh, when you get old enough and you want to graduate from the piggy bank method, um, start a savings account. Uh, you might need to go with your parents uh, to their bank, but you can open up a savings account in your name that can be for your uh, missionary fund. Uh, that way it will be safe and secure, the money you save will be, uh, and you'll also be able to earn interest on the money you're saving. Fifth, when you're old enough, see about getting a part-time job. When I was 16 years old, I got my first part-time job. I was flipping hamburgers at, at McDonald's. It was a great way for me to uh, start saving money towards my mission. Uh, if your parents don't want you to work during the, uh, the school year, that's fine. Um, maybe you can get a summer job, um, but uh, find, find some work when you're old enough uh, to start saving for your mission. Lastly, talk to your parents. Um, many of these options, if not all of them, are going to require uh, help from your parents. But talk to your parents about how your mission is going to be paid for um, and let them know you're saving for your mission and, and they'll be um, enthusiastic and, and very helpful in, in that process. Uh, I, I know the blessings of missionary work are great and that by saving for your mission and preparing in this way you're going to be uh, able to receive even more blessings from the missionary work you do.